Here we go again. Jesus, Sam, give it a break. There are only dreams. <laughs> you are, aren't you? Have you seen it in your face? Come on, Sam, they're only dreams. It's just like flushing the mental toilet. What? Like getting rid of all the all the old stuff, the worries, the disappointments, the doubts. Neil, please. I think you'd probably benefit from going to speak to someone. I don't think I don't think you have a I think you'll probably benefit from going to speak to someone. I said... I'm sorry, I can't work with this. Cut! <laughs> okay, take five, everybody. Just read the lines, Matthew. Why? They don't make any sense. Why not? Sam pushes the issue, Neil flips out, and storms off. What's the problem? But if Sam and Neil are such close friends, why wouldn't they just listen to each other and talk it out? I'm just trying to understand the characters. <sighs> Matt, he's not real. He doesn't have dreams, he doesn't have desires. When you're not playing him, he doesn't exist. So just read the words on the bloody page and we can all go home. I just don't understand how the audience can connect with a cipher. Oh, it worked for Twilight, didn't it? Okay, everybody, we're gonna go around again. 